so these graphite electrodes are dipped in molten al2o3 plus na2al f na2al f6 sorry na3al f6 it is a type of cryolite now the molten al2o3 and na3al f6 when mixed together here due to electrochemical principles the pure aluminium will be eliminated out outlet for aluminium now it works as cathode stainless steel cathode and it is a copper clamp present with graphite rods so this is isolation of or extraction of aluminium from bauxite so this is the chemical reaction next oxidation and reduction so remember as i told you just now during the extraction of metals from their ores oxidation and reduction takes place simultaneously oxidation and reduction takes place simultaneously for the extraction of pure metals or some elements from their ore for example we can represent isolation of chlorine from brine solution here when brine solution dissolved in water it produces or evaluates chlorine gas so what is our explanation here in every extraction methods like extraction of iron from iron ore extraction of copper from copper ores zinc from zinc ores and aluminum from alumina in all the processes it includes reduction of element or reduction of metal but sometimes in chemistry some of the elements are isolated or extracted through oxidation processes remember the oxidation state of chlorine is minus 1 whereas the oxidation state of chlorine here is cl2 that is zero so oxidation state increasing so which indicates oxidation process during extraction so this is oxidation reduction and the next one is refining the most important side heading we have to learn here is refining what is refining means here the extracted metal from their ore will have some impurities we how to eliminate the impurities present with extracted metal so the process of removal of impurities from crude metal is called as refining process of metal some methods are used for used to refine the crude metals based on the type of impurity contaminated or present with metal and type of metal so first or distillation by using distillation process we can eliminate the impurities present with the metal that is distillation so what is distillation means here by using this distillation process the metals which show less boiling point and less melting point will be separated from their impurities so examples zinc and mercury type of metals purified by using distillation process while we are going to distillate these so zinc and mercury are separated from their impurities and next one second method used to refine our metal crude metal to pure metal are liquation in this method 
generally the metals with less melting point will be purified by using liquidation method in this method the impure metal in liquid state or molten state or float onto surface so through which the impurities will be eliminated from the metal and the available metal is pure metal example is blister metal or blister copper similarly one more method used by us is polling for refining the metals we have to use polling what is polling the pure metal metal including their impurities are in its molten state placed in a container which is stirred with a wood okay so during this process while we are going to stir that impure metal with a wood so the impurities may eliminate as vapors or impurities may be may be attracted by wood so this process of refining or purification is called as polling whereas the fourth one the most important electrolysis or electrolytic refining electrolytic refining here during elect or in electrolytic refining we can pu get pure copper pure copper during this process we have to get a setup which is called as electrochemical cell in this electrochemical cell we have to take a solution which consists of same metal and one electrode this electrode is impure copper or impure metal whereas another electrode is pure same type of metal when these two are connected with a battery so the impurities present in copper will dis, uh, will going to absorb onto one electrode so this will completely become impure and another electrode will become pure so this process is called as electrolytic refining and next one is zone refining zone refining in this zone refining process the metals are introduced into in between high temperature areas the metals with high temperature wheels will turn right right side of the equipment to left side or left side of the equipment to right side with a belt so during this by using inert gases they can evaporate or escape the impurities present in metals can escape from this process this type of purification is called as zone refining whereas the last one is vapor phase refi refining vapor phase refining so what is vapor phase refining here the metals with their impurities are heated in a specified equipment under special circumstances during this process the vapors are collected the pure vapors of metals are collected which are converted into liquids followed by solids so this type of purification is called as vapor phase refining so this is refining what is refining means the extraction of metal with some impurities the resulting metal is called as crude metal we have to eliminate the impurities present with crude metal such process is called as the elimination of impurities from crude metal will takes place in refining process so various types of processes includes under refining that is for the conversion of crude metal into pure metal distillation liquidation polling electrolytic refining zone refining and vapor phase refining so this is refining of metals